a spectacular liftoff from the Space Coast. United Launch Alliance sending up its Atlas V rocket in the last 90 minutes on board a weather satellite for NOAA. But News 6's James Barvero reports the mission is not over yet. Three, two, one. And liftoff, liftoff of NOAA's ghost team. The most advanced weather satellite, which NASA and NOAA say will help protect more than a billion people in the Western Hemisphere, is on its way to orbit. The vehicle is now passing through max Q, maximum dynamic pressure. The United Launch Alliance Atlas V rocket blasting off at 438, the opening of a two-hour launch window with GOES-T. It's the 18th GOES weather satellite and the third in the latest series. Minutes after liftoff, a successful separation of the rocket's first stage from the upper stage with the satellite. What a shot there, huh? The mission underway despite a small percentage that weather could have spoiled liftoff. Reporting 80% favorable conditions, the Space Force did have to pay close attention to the wind. We do have pretty breezy conditions out there. Ultimately, though, the team's confident to give the go for launch. Now ULA says at about 8 o'clock tonight, Ghost T should separate from the upper stage of the rocket. And then on March 12th, NASA and NOAA say the satellite should reach its orbit 22,000 miles above the Earth. At NASA's Kennedy Space Center, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news 6.